to use as a backtrack and we'll have it in our computer we can uh, put this wave into the German stereo for that we need the help of the software jam manager XT which is this one I'm gonna open it up before we made a USB connection here we can see this connecting to the to the looper to the German stereo looper and we can see here that we have an internal memory in which in this case I, I have quite a few loops already here and then I have the external memory and as the car external which uh, I also have a couple of backtracks here and if I would like to put another wave to use as a backtrack instead of recording it straight to the jamman I can use this program for that you see here on the left it says library I have to click here well I've already have some waves here but uh, I'm gonna put a new one so you can see how it's done on these buttons here on the top when it says file edit view help the first one it says add new gem list we don't need this one but we need this one here this is add to library it's open the explorer in our computer and here we search for the wave we want to put in the gem and stereo in this case uh, well I'll try to put this one for example E minor impro mix I click on, on top of this and I say open it says I read here because it's Spanish but in English we say open so I say open and I can see that in the library list which is that one if I search for that new wave it's going to be here And yes, it's here. Is this one, for example? Now, when I want to put this from the library, which is still in the computer, to the German stereo looper, I have to click on this one here. So it's going to split the the view of the list in in two two parts. And on the down part it says library on the top part it says also library but this time I'm gonna search here for a here I choose if, if I want to copy the wave to the stereo internal or to the German stereo external in this case I'm gonna copy to the German stereo external so here I have I see the what's in the stereo external card of the German I can see if there is any file empty 24 is empty in this case but uh, let's say I want to copy it in the 34 so I click on the 34 and here on the library list I search again for the wave I want to copy it was this one I mark it to copy this one and, and I say paste. It's telling me that this operation cannot be undone. Do you want to proceed? Okay, yes. And here is copying the wave from the library part to the external card.
so takes a little bit of time to copy the, the whole wave but not very long and and now just appear here the this uh, new wave that I have it in the external card so now just using the German stereo looper I can use that as a backtrack for whenever I want to play it uh, on top of it or do some improvisation or whatever and this is how it sounds this looper and by the way 